Hey guys, it's Rosebud here, and welcome to another cast video. Today, we are doing the Newman family, and this family is going to be, um, part of my Let's Play, if I decide to do it. And I'm super excited to tell you guys that I'm starting this new series that I'm calling Let's Create a Family. And basically... I got the idea from Fantasia. She has a series on her channel called like, Let's Create a Sim Together, but she takes different things from different um, like subscribers and stuff like that of hers. That like like you know like a nose feature or eyebrows or eyes and personality trait and stuff like that. But I'm not doing that. I'm doing something a little bit different. Like I want you guys to give me like a theme of like what type of family I should do. And I would create it, like, based off of, like, what I think, think, like, it would look like in my head. So I think that would be kind of cool, something different. And that's basically where I got the idea from. But this one's a special one, because, like I said, i probably going to use this family if I decide to do a Let's Play. They're not going to be my main family. They are going to be, if maybe, like, a bigger family in my Let's Play. They are going to be, well, the girl in it is going to be the best friend of my main character. And you're yet to meet her. Right now we're making the mother. And yeah, I'm just like super excited to um, just like start like I guess like doing stuff on my channel. Because I know for like the past month, like when I was in school, it was very hard for me to make videos because I was so busy. And I know when I go back to school in the fall, it probably will be hard again and stuff like that. So that's why I thought that doing this like Kaz like, um, like series would be quite nice because going in Kaz is always relaxing and stuff like that it's easy to edit those videos and stuff like that so that's what I'm doing and that's why I decided to do it also too I think it would just be lots of fun for now I know I won't get lots of suggestions probably for different themes of different families I should do for the future but I guess until then then um I guess I could create the IT ideas and stuff like that but yeah eventually I would love for you guys to put your input for like what kind of families I should do. And right now we're creating the dad. Um, yeah, I go through some changes with the dad. I first give him this hair and I'm like, nah, I don't want to give him that hair. It just doesn't suit him. And then, yeah, I eventually, he eventually evolves and he wears this like dad shirt and I like love it because it just screams, I'm a dad. And it's just so funny. Um, yeah, and this family is meant to be like one of the more like idealistic families are kind of like I don't know they kind of remind me of like the Brady Bunch they're happy and they're they're nice and stuff like that and yeah and I will tell you a little bit more about the best friend because she's gonna be like the main part and the one that you're gonna see me like most often than I guess the rest of these guys and I do create her like a little bit on in the in the video but for now I'll just talk about her and she's basically the comic relief character I think She's going to be, like, the one that kind of, like, when everything's tough and stuff like that, she's always going to be there to, like, be a shoulder to cry on and, like, be the one who always, to, like, you know, like, tries to break the tension in the group and stuff like that. And she's, and I, she is a blonde and stuff like that. I make her clumsy and I, and I make her a goofball. But I don't want her to seem like that she's, like, the dumb blonde in, the, in, the, in like, the, let's play because she's not the dumb blonde she's just kind of she's more of the comic relief character is what I was going for and yeah I really like her she looks quite different and stuff like that right this is not her right now we're creating her older sister and she's based and anyway the best friend she's basically dating one of the guys in I guess the friend group and the friend group is composed of four people the main character her and two twin boys that you guys are yet to meet and yeah she's dating one of the twin boys and her and the other and her and one of the twin boys are like more of like the loud kind of like party people you know like the ones that like are always um well, I'm not gonna do well, yeah the ones that are like always like come on not in like kind of the adventurous ones out of the group um while the other two are, well, they're not necessarily quiet or, like, introverted, but they're definitely more low-key. They're more of, like, the serious, like, let's get, like, they're ones who, basically, when the other two get, in, get into trouble, they basically are there to save the day kind of night of people. And, yeah, I'll talk more about them later. 
and stuff like that. But right now, here is the sister that I'm creating. And the sister is a young adult. I expect her to be, um, like, a really, like... I don't know, I imagine her to be, like, a really hard-working, work like, girl. That's what I, like, pictured for her, like, her being, like, I could see her, like, being in business and stuff like that and being just, like, killing it and stuff like that. But her mother wants to see her, like, get married. And she's always like, when are you going to get married? When are you going to give me kids? And she's just not with anybody right now. And she's just, like, very career-driven and stuff like that. And I like that kind of idea because, like, I guess, too, while... She's definitely not the main focus of this Let's Play. I guess we could see her over time, um, like, see what she decides to do with her life and stuff, too, because she's, she's growing up, too. She's just very, like, she's at that point of her life that she's, like, she's just trying to do her. You know, you do you, boo. <laughs> and right now, we're gonna create the best friend, and, yeah. I really like this family. They, like... I do like this family because I don't really necessarily create, like, a lot of, like, big families with, like, different, like, age groups and stuff like that. So, I kind of like that I I did this and stuff. Because I usually would create, like, the four people family all the time for my, like, personal gameplay. So, I feel like it's kind of nice having, like, a bigger family and stuff too. Especially since our main character doesn't have a big family. I feel like she'd be close with this family as well. Um, and yeah, I go through lots of changes, too, about, like, what I want her hair to be like. But I decided to go with the one with bangs because I feel like it suited her really, really well. And, yeah. Um, anyway, guys, how have you been? I have just, I've been good. I've just been, like, working on this stuff in the background. And you guys are going to see, too, that I'm going to put out a collab. Unless I've already put out a collab by the time I post this. I'm not exactly sure. But yeah, I'm doing a collab, and I'm super excited about that as well because I'm doing it with another I guess friend that I've like made here on YouTube and yeah I would love to see what you guys are doing um let me know if you guys are out of school or not and stuff like that or if you guys are working um yeah anyway I will be I I will be like continuing to post, post different like families up here like for the um for the let's play and stuff but i am not gonna show you guys my main family until i guess the, the first part when i whenever i do it and um or if i do it like like i said i'm not, not exactly sure i'm still like working out the details and seeing like how far this can go before i decide to make it like a real let's let's play basically in my head because like I don't want it to be, like, a total flop. Like, I kind of, like, want, like, more or less, like, a structure and a plan for how this is going to go. Because while I like Let's Plays or just kind of, like, family Let's Plays to be, like, okay, kind of just, like, where are we going to go with this and we just kind of, like, do it kind of thing. I kind of do want more of a structure to, to mine. Like, I'm, mean, like, basically, like, a rough outline about, like, what's going to happen. Because I really like things that, like, follow a story and stuff like that as well as family Let's Plays. And I feel like, I guess you guys nice could, like, I guess I could better showcase what I'm doing if you guys have, like, an idea of, like, what I'm gonna, like, like, what I'm doing with this channel, you know, like, how I really, how I really, like, play kind of thing. Because I feel like, I don't know, I feel like definitely I will do just, like, a low-key let's play in the future, I definitely will, but I do, like, want to show you guys, you know, like, what I can do, you know, like, like, it doesn't have to just be, like, we're gonna start off with one sim and we're gonna get married and stuff like that like it ha can be like interesting it can be dramatic it can be sad and that's why i find that like the most i guess the fun the funnest people i i tend to like watch here that are simmers have some sort of like storyline going for them you know whether it's small or big like i like like some sort of story in my let's play and I kind of, I don't know, I find it kind of important, too, that even when you do a challenge, I feel like story before, before rules, at least in my opinion, just because I feel like, I don't know, because, like, everybody can do, like, the same challenge, for example, but, like, who, who wants to see the same Let's Play over and over and over and over, and, like, you know, you, I feel like different things bring it different, like, like, if you have a story and stuff like that, that can make your Let's Play a little bit more unique than the other person that's doing the other one. You know what I mean? At least in my opinion it is, just because, 
yeah, I feel like that that's important. As well as, too, is how charismatic the person is, too. I feel like the more charismatic the person is, it's obviously easier to watch somebody who's, like, more into it instead of just, like, monotone. Yeah, I say this, though, and I'm, like, sound like such, like, a blah person because I'm just, like, still getting used to, um recording these types of things but yeah I am having fun like learning how to do this and it is a process it is you don't actually realize how much work it is to like do YouTube until you start doing it yourself and yeah it's a lot of fun but it's a lot of work and yeah anyway I'm I think we're going back and like doing all of our other outfits right now and stuff um yeah how is your, it's summer for me right now, so how's weather with you guys? It's, um, is it going well? I, I mean, is it, is it going well? What, why would the weather be going well? You don't have control over the weather. I mean, how is the weather, like, with you guys? Is it cold? Is it warm? I know, depending on where, where you live, it's either going into winter or either going into summer. Right now, it's going into summer for me. And, yeah, it's just been, it's been nice. It's just, like, it's nice when it's warm. Sorry guys, I got cut off before, but now I'm back. I'm sorry about that. There was a lot of noise in the background, and yeah, I just, I, I wanted this top then because it was just too much noise in the background, and I just couldn't handle it. The dog is barking, like my neighbor's dog, it's just making so much noise. I think they got like a new dog or something like that, and it's been barking like all the time during the day, and it's, just, it's a little annoying, <laughs> especially when you want to record, because then you're just like, why? Why do you have to bark? Put your dog in, please. He does not want to be outside, clearly. Anyway, yeah, I was talking about this family, and yeah, um, we are finishing up on the, on her outfits, like the sister's outfits. I forgot if I have to go back and do the moms and the dads. I don't quite remember. It's been a while since I record for this. I do record things, like, ahead of time and then I go back and I um like re-watch the videos and like you know like talk talk through them with you guys um so that's why sometimes I forget like what I did because I don't do it right away I usually like record a bunch of things first and then I go back and like you know record my sound and yeah just kind of relax and I do that also too I've been I've been getting, like, a bunch of new CC and cleaning stuff out, so you're gonna, like, see over time, too, like, that some things that were in here now are not in here again anymore. I feel like that's very important, you know, like, kind of, like, doing, you know, like, like, your own closet, you know, you don't keep all the things that you have. You, you know, like, give stuff to the poor or, or the Cancer Federation or or whatever too and you clean out your closet you know you do uh, you do other things with it or you sell them whatever you do with them and just like that I feel like it's important to like you know clean out your closet as much as it is to go CC shopping and yeah I really recommend you guys doing that every once in a while because it does help quite a bit and why keep things if you're not going to use them you know we are coming like to the end of the build like pretty pretty soon and I just want to take the opportunity to say that thank you guys for watching so much. Um, it means a lot to me when you guys subscribe. I am new and it just, it makes my day when you guys do that. Because I do put a lot of work in these videos and I really, I really enjoy this. So please comment, rate, and subscribe. Um, have a wonderful day or a wonderful night and I'll speak to you soon. Bye, bye, bye.